if you don't want to miss out any of our uploads all you have to do is just turn on the notification bell and anytime we upload a new video you're going to receive an alert on your phone from youtube assalamu alaikum The last question, that of uh, masturbation, and this is an issue over which, of course, scholars have differed. Some say it's haram, some say it's makru. Uh, if you ask me what is your view, personally, uh, personally, I, my view is that it is makru, in that the rulings for something to be haram you know it needs clear texts and really in this action there are not clear texts there are implications people are drawing implications so i would be wary or shy to say haram however no doubt it is not a good thing. It doesn't solve whatever problem a person is thinking of solving. It does create problems for people later on when they get married, etc., where that became a habit and they can't get fulfilled in normal husband wife relations. I've big cases people came to me and complained about this. You know, this can happen. This is not a good thing. And the Prophet Sallallahu when he gave the options for that, those who are not able to fast, he didn't say, you can masturbate. No. He said, I mean, sorry, those who are not able to get married, he said, fast. That's what he said. So fasting has been given to us as the way of controlling our desires in this regard. So that's what we should do. Take that which the Prophet Sallallahu gave us. Masturbation is a sin. An individual cannot sexually entertain himself unless it's with his wife or with what his ha right hand possesses, and which is not available at, at, at the present time. So a person can only entertain himself sexually with his wife. She can do whatever she wants with him and he can do whatever he wants with her providing that the Islamic uh, boundaries are followed which is not the proper place to discuss them now. Masturbation, Allah Azza wa Jal described it as a form of transgression because he told us that the believers preserve their private parts except from their wives and what their right hand possesses and whoever seeks his pleasure other than these two then he would be committing a form of transgression therefore when you come to such a question if a person is sexually excited is it permissible for him to masturbate the answer is no because during the day and the night with present day's media internet chatting, phone calls, SMSs, magazines, newspapers, billboards, etc. People are constantly excited sexually because they're not lowering their gaze. They're not following the Quran and the Sunnah. And that is why they're always hyper. So does this mean that this sin becomes permissible? The answer is no. It is forbidden to commit such an evil when a person is excited, if he is excited, then he should do what Allah or the Prophet commanded him to do, and that is to get married.